hopefully you remember the equation when you need to look for x, which is i minus a inverse times d. First, we need to find out i minus a, which is 1 minus all these. So 1 minus 0.4 is 0.6. This is point 1 minus 0.2 is 0.8. 1 minus 0.8 is 0.2. And 1 minus 0.2 is 0.8. Now we need the inverse of that. We need the inverse of that. And to find the inverse easily, we're going to use the 1 minus 8, 1 over, 1 over AD minus BC. AD is 0.48. BC is 0.16. We flip the a and d, 0 0.8 and 0 0.6. We negate these two, point, negative 0 0.8 and negative 0 0.2. And we take that times d, which is 40 and 70. 0 0.48 minus 0 0.16 is 0 0.32. So we have 0 0.8 over 0 0.32, negative 0 0.8 over 0 0.32, negative 0 0.2 over 0 0.32, and 0.6 over 0.32. This is quite a mess, but let's keep going. Uh, this is actually 1 fourth. This is negative 1 fourth. Uh, one six, this is negative 1 sixteenth. And this is 3 sixteenths. And now I, I'm going to move this up a bit. So let's move the 40 and 70 up here like this. And get rid of this here. Multiplying 1 fourth times 40 is 10. Negative 1 fourth times 70 is going to be uh, 70 over 4. So this is 40 over 4 minus 70 over 4, which is negative 30 over 4. And we don't have to calculate the y because we asked for x1. So this is your final answer.